tropical day trip. Pepper and George are on a cruise ship holiday with Granny and Grandpa Pig. Wake up, George! <laughs> there are lots of things to do on this boat. Well, actually, Pepper, we will be getting off the boat today. Is it the end of the holiday? No. <laughs> We're a long, long way from home. We thought it would be nice to get off and have a look around. Step this way for the tropical island day trip. Why are we going in a little boat, Granny? The big boat is too big to stop at a tropical island. This is a tropical island. Welcome to our island! Oh, how wonderful! This is rather pleasant. Thank you very much. <laughs> this is the tropical island marketplace. Can we buy something, Granny? I don't see why not. Grandpa Pig has found a colourful shirt. This looks rather fun. Granny Pig has found a tropical gnome. And this would look lovely in our garden. Of course you can, Peppa. <laughs> George wants that little guitar. This is actually a ukulele. It's a very calming musical instrument when played correctly. Ukulele! <laughs> yes, please, we'll take it. a little wooden box with holes in it. Oh. It's a present for my pet beetle, Bernard. <gasps> I need to get a present for Goldie, my pet fish. What does Goldie like? She likes swimming around and going like this. Maybe Goldie would like a cuddly whale. Yes. <coughs> Can we get this for Goldie the fish? That's a kind thought, Peppa. Hello, Grandpa Pig. Doing a bit of tourist shopping, are we? Oh, uh, yes. Oh, so are we. Can't resist. I think we have to go and make a phone call now. I need to speak to Goldie. Toodle pip. Bye. Here is the Tropical Island Telephone. I wonder what everyone on the other side of the world is doing now. Uh, hello? Who is this? It's me, Daddy! I'm on holiday, remember? Oh, Peppa, how's the holiday? It is very nice. Can I speak to Goldie, please? It's Peppa, for you. Hello, Goldie! I am on a big boat with a pirate and a mermaid and we saw a whale. And do you remember me? <laughs> Are you all enjoying yourselves? Yes, Mummy. Here is George. George, hello. What's the best thing about your holiday? Potato. Potato? Potato? <laughs> Pepper and George are going back to the cruise ship. Well, I think you will all agree. That was splendid. Yes, Granny Pig. Nothing else we do today could top that experience. Potato. Except for a ride on Potato, of course. Hello, Granny Pig. What can I sell you today? Mr Fox, <coughs> what are you doing here? I've got a shop. There are a lot of people on board this ship who need things, like an egg on a stick, a top hat, or a pirate beard. Oh, that's just what I was looking for. See what I mean? We built some things too. So I see. Well, if you need anything else, come to me. I know what I need. Some food. Who else is hungry? Me! Yeah, oh, me. me! Pepper and George are eating dinner on the deck of the cruise ship. Pigetti! <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow, the holiday cruise ship will take Pepper and George home. Holiday on the sea! Pepper and George are on a cruise ship holiday with Granny and Grandpa Pig. <gasps> We've won a big boat on the sea. <laughs> <laughs> there are so many things to do on this boat. What do we do first, Granny? I think we should have breakfast. Ah, but would that be a mermaid breakfast or a dinosaur breakfast? <gasps> dinosaur! Grr. 
<laughs> this is the Dinosaur Cafe. Morning! Would you like some dinosaur breakfast eggs? Dinosaur breakfast eggs have spots on them. Wow! <laughs> Ahoy there, sailors! My name is Pirate Pete and this is Mrs Mermaid. Please come to our fancy dress show tonight. We'll all have lots of fun. Oh, yes. We should go to the show tonight. But before that, what would you like to do? Trampolines? Splash pools? Mini golf? No, no, no! Why not just try them? Everything on this cruise ship is free. Is it really? Yes, except the ride-on potato. Ooh. George wants to do the ride-on potato. <laughs> potato! Good. You stay here with George. Pepper and I will find something else to do. <laughs> Trampolines! Yippee! Here is Rohan Rhino. Hello, Peppa. Hello, Rohan. Do you want to play in the mermaid splash pool? Yes! Let's go! <laughs> Granny! Oh, have you finished bouncing already? Maybe that's enough potato for one day, George. Potato! Potato! Oh. <laughs> this is the mermaid splash pool. <laughs> this is fun! <laughs> that's it, George. I have no more coins left. Oh. Hello, boys. We need to get ready for the show. It is showtime on the cruise ship. Everyone has dressed up to watch. Ooh. Good evening, boys and girls. I'm Pirate Pete. I sailed around the seas and treasure was my wish. But nothing did I find there except a great big fish. Oi, I'm a mermaid, not a fish. <laughs> Do you want to come look for treasure? I don't need to. I've got a magic box. Ooh. It will give you whatever you wish for. Just say the magic word. Which is? Uh, oh, I've forgotten. Sorry, memory like a fish. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows a magic word? A candelabra. What? A candelabra? <laughs> no, it's not working. Mrs. Mermaid, can you check the box is not broken? <laughs> Oh, abracadabra! Ooh. Look at that! Chocolate coins for everyone! <laughs> but wait! My new friend, Mrs. Mermaid, has gone! <gasps> Who can help me magic her back? Me! I can help you! Aha! Come up on stage! <laughs> What's your name? I'm Peppa Pig! <laughs> So, Pepper Pig, what do we do to get Mrs. Mermaid back? Say the magic word! Abracadabra! Ta -da! <laughs> and that is the end of the show! Good night, everyone! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a wonderful day. I can't think how it could be any more special. Ah! What was that? It's a whale! Wow. wow! She's saying night, night! It is bedtime on the holiday cruise ship. Tomorrow will be another day. Water park! Pepper and her family have come to the water park today. Hello, everyone! Miss Rabbit is in charge. These are the changing rooms. Please change into your swimming costumes. Yes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Daddy Pig is wearing his swimming costume. <laughs> Mummy Pig is wearing her swimming costume. <laughs> Pepper is wearing her swimming costume. <laughs> and George is wearing his swimming costume. <laughs> <laughs> this looks amazing. There's bubbles and slides and all kinds of watery fun. <laughs> this is the Bubble Bay. Pedro Pony is here with his mummy. Hello, Peppa. Let's play in the bubbles. Bubbles! <laughs> 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 the bubbles 
lift you up and tickle you. <laughs> oh, yes. That feels good. <laughs> oh, lovely. Bubbly, wobbly, bouncy bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> this is the tipping bucket. Mandy Mouse is here with her mummy. Hello, Peppa. Squeak. Hello, Mandy. You've got to try this. It's brilliant. What do I do? You wait here until the bucket is full. Then what happens? <laughs> Something sounds like fun. Can I have a go? Yes, Mummy. You go next. What do I do? You wait here until... Until what? <laughs> Wet. Although, I suppose that is the point of coming to a water park. Oh, oh, let's do the water slides. Here are the water slides. There's a tiny slide for little children and a really big, ginormous slide for the people who like that kind of thing. Look at me on the slide. <laughs> That's very high. <laughs> Daddy Pig does not like heights. <laughs> George, let's do the tiny slide. <laughs> Mummy, Daddy, you have to watch us. OK, we're watching. <laughs> Ready, steady, go! <laughs> <laughs> that looks fun. I'm going to have a go. OK. We'll stay here and watch you. Sorry, Daddy Pig. You can't wear glasses on the water slides. Oh. I'll look after them for you. Daddy Pig cannot see very well without his glasses. Oh, dear. These are the steps to the big, ginormous slide. Daddy, we're waiting. Sorry. I have to go slow without my glasses. Daddy's taking a long time to climb up the tiny slide. Hurry up, Daddy! <laughs> These steps are taking forever. Where is Daddy? There he is! Hello, Daddy Pig. I didn't think you liked heights. Eh? Daddy Pig cannot see where he is. What are you doing up there, Daddy Pig? Sorry, what did you say? Daddy Pig cannot hear because he is so high up. Sit back and enjoy the ride. OK. Here goes. Wow, Daddy Pig! You did the big ginormous slide. Oh, oh. You are brilliant! Here are your glasses, Daddy Pig. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. That was actually the best fun ever. Maybe it helped that I couldn't see anything. <laughs> Daddy Pig loves the water park. Everyone loves the water park. <laughs> Families. Pepper and her friends are at playgroup. Children, today we are going to do drawings of our families. Ooh. This is me. I live on my own in a very tall house. Sometimes my two sisters come to visit. And we play music. Greta plays bass. Gretel plays drums. And I play guitar. We rock! That is my family. Now it is your turn. <laughs> this is me, Susie Sheep. I live with my mummy. She likes to push me on the swing. <laughs> Higher, mummy! Higher! <laughs> and that is my family. I am Mandy Mouse. Here is me with Mummy and Daddy. We like playing in the park. To you, Mandy. Squeak! <laughs> to you, Daddy. <laughs> yes, everyone likes playing in the park. Who's next? Me. What a lovely drawing, Pedro. This is Mummy and Daddy and me, Pedro Pony. I have glasses. Daddy has glasses. 
Mummy has contact lenses. Amazing. How about the panda twins? Pandora and Peggy are doing their drawing together. Daddy is a police officer. And Mummy is a firefighter. Sometimes Daddy drives us in his police car. Daddy, can we do the siren? Yes, please can we do the siren. Now, girls, you know the siren is only for emergencies. Please! Oh, all right then. <laughs> Super! And Danny Dog? My daddy is a sea captain. He has adventures on his boat. But now daddy has come home to me and mummy. And he won't go back to sea ever, ever, ever again. <laughs> what a wonderful adventure. Who's next? I'm Penny Polar Bear. I live with my mummy and my other mummy. One mummy is a doctor and one mummy cooks spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Lovely, Penny. And Freddy Fox? My dad has a van. It has everything in the world inside it. In packs of five. <laughs> Super. And Rebecca? This is me with Mummy, Daddy, Richard, Rosie and Robbie. We live in a hill. Sometimes my auntie Miss Rabbit visits. Oh, it's nice to have a break from all my jobs. A rescue service, please. I'm stuck up a mountain and I need rescuing. Oh, Dad, not again. OK, I'm on my way. Miss Rabbit is always busy because she does all the jobs in the world. Yes, what would we do without Miss Rabbit? Who's next? I am Peppa Pig. And this is Mummy and Daddy and my little brother George. George thinks his toy dinosaur is scary. <coughs> it is not scary. But if I don't play, he cries. <coughs> It's hard work having a little brother. <laughs> the parents are here to collect the children. Hello. Hello, mummies and daddies. Come and find yourself on our wall. Oh, is that me? Yes, mummy. And that's you, daddy. Oh, oh, it looks exactly like me. Yes, what wonderful drawings of the families. I love families. Peppa <laughs> loves families. Everyone loves families. Motorbiking. It is a lovely sunny day in Granny and Grandpa Pig's garden. Peppa and George are helping Grandpa Pig with his raspberry patch. A little bird has come to look at Grandpa Pig's raspberries. <laughs> ah! Shoo, shoo! Cheeky birds. Eat my raspberries, would you? The little birds like your raspberries, Grandpa. So do I. It's a good job I'm here to make sure they don't eat them all. Grandpa Pig, I've just had a wonderful idea. Let's go camping. Camping? Camping! <laughs> we could camp in the garden. No. Let's drive somewhere, find a nice spot and pitch a tent. But our car is at Grandad Dog's garage, being fixed. Oh, yes. What about the old motorbike? Motorbike? Yes. Grandpa and I have had many adventures on our motorbike when we were younger. Whee! <laughs> ah, yes. That was fun. But it was a long time ago, Granny Pig. All the more reason for us to get the old motorbike out again. <laughs> Here it is! Motorbike! What's this funny thing on the side? It's called a sidecar, Pepper. You and George can sit in it. What about my raspberries? You can't take your garden with you, Grandpa. Come on, it'll be fun to get away for a bit. I suppose so. But if we're going to go, I just need to make sure my raspberries will be safe. Pepper and George, you play in the garden while I pack a bag for the trip. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> 
There. What are you doing with your raspberries, Grandpa? I'm keeping them safe from those pesky birds. Are you planting them in your shed? Um, sort of. Here we are, bags packed and ready to go camping. What are you wearing, Granny? This is my motorcycle jacket. It keeps me warm on the motorbike. Oh, my raspberries will now be safe and sound. Let's go. Very good. Do you have the helmets and goggles? Here they are. You must wear a safety helmet if you ride on a motorbike. All aboard. Yes, Granny Pig. Which way should we go? That way. The seaside. Hooray! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> This is the life! <laughs> <laughs> Granny's motorbike goes brum 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 Granny's motorbike goes brum 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 all day long! <laughs> <laughs> this is Grandad Dog's garage. Hello! Fill her up, please, Grandad Dog. Granny Pig! I didn't know you had a motorcycle. Yes. We're using it while you fix our car. Well, the car is fixed. You can take it now. Oh. oh. If you don't mind, I think we'll pick it up later. We're having too much fun on the motorbike. Bye. 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 Granny's motorbike goes brum, brum, brum all day long. <laughs> <laughs> Pepper and George have arrived at the seaside. Hooray! Let's camp here. But, Granny, we've forgotten the tent. No, we haven't, Pepper. This is a very special camping motorbike. Watch this! Wow! The motorbike has turned into a tent. It's a magic tent. Yes, Pepper. We've got everything we need to sleep by the sea. Hooray! I hope you're not missing your raspberries too much, Grandpa Pig. Not at all, because I made a few adjustments to the motorbike this morning and brought my garden too. Wow! Your raspberry patch! <laughs> Grandpa Pig loves camping, especially when he can bring his garden with him. Pepper and George are at playgroup with their friends. Children, today we are going to play with hoops. Ooh. Playing with hoops is a super fun way to exercise. And exercise is good for you. Yes, exercise gets your body working and your heart pumping. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Take a hoop each. <laughs> there are lots of ways to exercise with a hoop. We will start by throwing it into the air like this. Hoopla! And catch. Now you try. Hoopla! <laughs> Very good. Now let's try rolling your hoops along the floor and running after them. <laughs> now lie your hoops on the ground. Add the jump from one hoop to the other. Jump, 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 jump. Jump, 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 Madame Gazelle is spinning the hoop around her middle. You try! Everyone is trying to spin their hoops. Madame Gazelle, I can't do it. It's not working. My hoop is not very spinny. It is difficult to spin a hoop around your middle. Don't be sad if you cannot do it straight away. It takes a lot of practice to get it right. It is home time. Take your hoops and practice at home, children. <laughs> Look, Mummy, we've got hoops to take home. Oh, wonderful. Daddy, Daddy! 
Look what we've got! Wow! Hoops! They are for exercise! I see! Madam Gazelle says exercise makes your heart go, uh, boom, bang, boom! That sounds great! You throw them up in the air like this! Hoopla! Hoopla! And catch them like this! Very good, Daddy! And you roll them like this! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> and you jump on them like this! <laughs> oh, that looks fun! You can do it too, Mummy! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that was good! My heart is certainly going boom, bang, boom! <laughs> but the best thing ever is to spin the hoop like this. Oh. Uh, it's very hard to do. May I have a go? OK. But don't be sad if you can't do it, Mummy. Right, here we go. Ready, steady, go! <laughs> <laughs> Mummy Pig can spin the hoop. Wow! Very good! Have another go, Pepper. Ready, steady, go. Ah, uh, I'll never do it. I've got an idea. Hold on, don't move. Where is Daddy going now? <laughs> I think this will do it. You've got to spin. What you need is music to spin to. Ready, steady, go. Hooray! <laughs> Spin her hoop. George can spin his hoop. We're doing it, George. <laughs> you clever piggies. Pepper and George love spinning hoops. Everybody loves spinning hoops. <laughs> Detective Club. Pepper and her friends are playing in their clubhouse. Let's play detectives. This is our detective club, and we will solve mysteries. Ooh. We have to find a mystery. Yes, we can use the telephone. Hello? We are important detectives, and we need a mystery. They said go outside. But that's a wooden telephone. It doesn't work. We're playing a game, Susie. Ah, oh, OK. <laughs> Daddy, we are a detective. Club. That sounds lovely. We solve mysteries. Fantastic. Uh, only problem is it's actually time for us to go home. Oh, but I want to play some more. You can come back to the clubhouse tomorrow. OK, Daddy. Bye, Peppa. Bye. Bye. Oh, the car's locked. Daddy Pig cannot open the car door. Uh... And I don't seem to have the key. Until I've found my key, we can't go home. Hooray! We can play more! <laughs> Come back to the detective club, Peppa. <laughs> uh, I wonder if your detective club can help me find my key. Yes, that's a real mystery. OK, <laughs> we'll help you, Daddy. Thank you. The key must be somewhere around here. If we all crawl around looking on our hands and knees, we might find it. No, we are detectives. We do not crawl around on our hands and knees. I see. We have clever ways to do things. Maybe there's a way to open the car without a key. Um, we could ring the police. Yes, they can open locked cars. Phone the police. This is the police station. Slow day today. If only we had something to do. <sighs> Phone the police? That's brilliant. Uh, only problem is, where have I put my phone? It's in the car. Daddy Pig's phone is locked inside the car. That's not good. <laughs> Grumpy Rabbit. Can I use your phone? Sorry, old chap. I left my phone at home. But looks like there's a phone in the clubhouse. Fantastic. Uh, how do I use this thing? It's a toy phone. It's made of wood. Let me have a go. I do have quite a loud voice. Help! 
Grumpy Rabbit has the loudest voice in the world. Someone's calling for help. We've got ourselves a job. To the police car. Did someone shout for help? Yes, we've got an emergency. What kind of emergency? Flood? Earthquake? Tornado? Um, I'm locked out of my car. Daddy can't drive us home. Good thing you called us. That was our idea. Good work, children. We'll take it from here. Daddy Pig, where is your car key? I've lost it. Key is lost. This might sound very silly, but have you looked in all the obvious places, like your pockets? My key! Daddy Pig's key was in his pocket. That's funny. I didn't even know I had pockets. Mystery solved. All thanks to the quick thinking of these young children. We are detectives. And this is our clubhouse. Very smart. I wish we had a clubhouse. We do. It's called the police station. Yes, but the police station doesn't have a slide or a swing. Yes, our clubhouse is the best in the whole world. Pepper and her friends love the clubhouse. Everyone loves the clubhouse. 